Good day, hello, I'm Richard, and I want to welcome you back to Push-Ups for PTSD, day 1580, where I'm looking to raise awareness for PTSD and mental health with daily push-ups. Day 8 for the month, and day 1 for the new weekly goal to raise awareness, and maybe some donations for wounded warriors. Seeing as you're all pretty keen individuals, I figure you've already seen the awareness goal for the week hasn't changed. Reset to zero from 450 for the views, and zero out of 200 for the likes. Didn't quite make the goal last week, but I've tried to do some background things and reconfigure my channel a bit, so hopefully that'll help some. Of course, the big thing is, I need you all to like and share to any social media sites you may frequent, any forums, message boards, or chats. Please share wherever you feel comfortable. Just to keep it relevant, I'm going to remake the polls for the goal incentive. It'll be up for the next seven days, with the two options still available, so either wacky outfit during a day of push-ups or eating the viral two times spicy Korean noodle challenge are still up for grabs. By the time you're watching this, the poll will already be active on my community page. Getting into today's sets and how I felt in general, gotta say I felt pretty poor. Just generally ill for the most part, had a poor night's sleep, and I've had a small headache developing for most of the morning. If I am coming down with something, which I'm not sure if I am or not, luckily it hasn't affected my endurance as it has in the past. I didn't feel as explosive today, but that could be because I'm starting at the bottom and trying to get into pull-ups as well. So I did quite a few assisted ones last night. I imagine that has had a bit of an effect on my arms today. Still managed to get through each rep though today without any major pauses. So I'm always happy about that. So this month I've decided to support Wounded Warriors Canada for all of January and half of any revenue or donations I make will go to support their efforts and practices. Wounded Warriors Canada is a national mental health service provider utilizing clinical best practices and evidence informed care to create an environment of compassion, resiliency and hope for Canada's veterans, first responders, and their families. Now, I want you to know that I am here for you. You're not alone. You are worthy and deserving of love and respect, and you don't need to apologize for your illness. There are treatments available. Please seek help if you need it. If you ever feel like life is too much for you right now, make sure to turn to friends, family, professionals, or even random YouTubers for help. It's never too late to ask, and there's a bunch of people out there more than willing to provide whatever help they can. I do have phone numbers and links in the description below to services around the world. The code word for today is COWS. If you're looking to sponsor a day or week of push-ups, which will benefit this month, Wounded Warriors Canada, and helps with my own monthly costs, then you can find my email address to the channel's about section, and we can discuss things further through there. I hope you're all doing well. Take care of yourselves. Stay safe. Stay strong. Most importantly, thank you for surviving.